Hey guys, you know who this is? Blazing Stormer, you know, the disabled saint. And today, he's playing Red Dead Redemption 2. Today, we are a part of robbing a fucking train with the HFSS. With the squad. Okay, squad, you can talk. Okay, well this lady here is going to disappear. I'm going to do my Christmas tree here. Okay. Uh, Introduce his squad, of course. So, why don't you guys introduce yourself? Then I'm going to disappear. Do you want me to use your real names or do you have fake names? <laughs> Bob. Bob. We're riding cowboy. Hey. And, and I'm Bear Well, howdy, cowboy. Hey. Okay, well, you guys have fun. Yeah. Howdy, howdy. 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 Oh. <laughs> Are you still hard tied? <sighs> yeah, so while I took him hard tied while we were in a posse, I could leave him hard tied. That's hilarious. Oh, yeah, Karis and Tommy Reed. I love this one. This is the funnest mission. What you do elsewhere don't bother me or my mistress one job. But good, bad, or indifferent, you gotta make yourself a living. This is Samson Finch. Yep. Mr. Finch is like you or like me. There's a bone to pick with some fellas that did him a wrong. That I do. Tell him about it. I ain't gonna lie to you. Truth is, I'm a bad bastard. I get my way, but I stuck to my word and did what I said I would. Especially to them, it's stuck by me. Mr. Finch has a little predicament. I was finding a job, a good job. The thing took a goddamn year. It's gonna make me pretty rich. Then my partner went yellow and betrayed me. If you and your bunch would help me do this robbery and get back at it. But like I said, I ain't never betrayed no one. I ain't about to stop. Plus, well, this is a fine job. If I had a group I could trust, it'd all be well. So you will. Now, I ain't gonna pretend it's not a nasty business. We're robbing robbers that know it. Not outlaws, but real robbers. Industrials. And and good luck, everyone. But I've heard quite enough for me to join you at the gallows should things go wrong. How about you ride with me and I explain more about it? 
It's a nasty plan. Farley, I see you around, friend. Sure. Just try to stay out of too much trouble. I'll see you soon, I'm sure. And if you should choose to amend your ways and try a different path, well, I'm sure Mr. Jones could help guide you a little. Come with me, friend. Here's the plan. He's industrial, Mr. Rock. He's some of the worst folk I know. All right, that kerosene and tar plant up the way. They got a train of strike breakers and killers from some detective agency coming in by train. Fresh off some other recent incident. You're going to jump this train, deal with the black-hearted bastards on board, and ride it all the way to the refinery, okay? Once you're there, the guards are going to know you're not detective. Boring. So get ready for a fight. Anyway, the yeah. men with the money are probably be in the upstairs office of the refinery. Their cash is yours to divide amongst yourselves after. If I hadn't been betrayed by my partners, my brothers in arms, I'd be with you myself. But now I got to go and make a nuisance of myself in Valentine. So they don't round me up and fit me with a rope necktie for this. It's enough for me to know that it's done is all. I need to go kill a deer real quick. I'm coming back. Now, your train will be coming from the east. You need to make it stop or find a way on board. These are detectives, thugs, train bullies. They aren't scared of anything. I have no reason to believe they won't pull the brake for you. Who is she saying in that train's way? But if you give them a reason to be suspicious, the violence will be quick and absolute. I am sure you are more than capable of getting it done. Me? I've never been very good at playing with others. So I might hold tight associate, leave him on the track, and stand back under the bridge. But that part of the plan is up to you. Right. What do you guys want to do? Do you want to hide? Or do you want to take him on? Hey. I like running a little further up ahead here, intercepting them so they can't get to that stupid machine gun. Yeah. We gotta make sure Blazing can get to the things so they can pull up. Get his choo choo on. Yeah. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Run over a bunch of run over a bunch of dude guys. Oh yeah. Push control your gun while you're in the horse. Oh. Here we go. Hey, Following you. Well, here it goes. I guess we're doing it. Uh, I didn't jump. I did the exact opposite of jumping. Huh? 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 Huh, huh. Oh, huh. 
Huh. Oh god, the thing just went to you. Were you able to stop the train? No lies lost. Um, he shot me. How did you shot on him? Hold, up. hold on, hold on. I can't get a clear shot on him. I keep doing the animation to get up. Hold on. Oh, I just did a clear shot. Revive, 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 revive. Thank you. I'm moving this one to fire. Oh, Jared. I'm going to do my best action. <laughs> I'm going to right. get on this maxing gun over here. Make sure to stop us right after the, uh, right at the entrance. So pull the, pull the speed engine just past the, uh, the big main doors. So oh, yeah. Oh, the best, baby. Don't. It's okay, buddy. Hi, horse. Don't, don't run over by the sun, dude. Still got the uh, dudes. Just sits up here. No place for you. Anybody got dynamite? I got dynamite.
catch him, catch him. In GTFO. And we're ready. Missing our objective. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, jeez, oh, jeez. Just keep running. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. That's right. <laughs> I'm going to need your help. <laughs> Take the trailer on the way out. That's hilarious. <laughs> 